Hello, welcome back to Daniel's DIY channel. Today we're going to be making this concrete succulent planter. Um, you can put succulents in it or small plants or um, you can put other stuff in it too, pens, uh, paper clips, whatever. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoy the video. If you do, give it a thumbs up and like always, subscribe. So with my leftover concrete, I'm currently making my countertops. Uh, the concrete I have left over in this little container here that I was using to fill in the holes. Uh, I'm going to make a flower pot out of that, so I'll show you how to do that. Uh, so you can see, you just have some concrete in there. Uh, you can use any little container that you're mixing it in. You can make, make a, you can even make a big one if you use like a, a bucket. Um, I actually have one of those I made the other day. Um, but this one, I'm just going to make a small one here, probably for like a succulent. Um, so you got concrete. You just need another little container. Uh, you're gonna shove that right down in the middle of it. So that'll be the inside of the pot. Pound that a little bit. Vibrate it a little bit to get all the air bubbles out. Yeah, it's really as easy as that. And I'll come back to the video and I'll show you the end result. So even though I used the rapid set, I forgot I did put in some of the um, set control, uh, which actually slows down the setting process. Uh, so I came back an hour later and it was still, still soft. It wasn't hard yet. Uh, so I just waited uh, 24 hours overnight. Um, and now I'm back. Uh, so when you come out here, you just want to just kind of flex the, the plastic a little bit. Pull it apart, squish it together, just to break the, break the hold it has on there. And that should just kind of pop right out. Just like that. And then you'll want to, should just be able to twist it off here. Maybe. You pound it a little bit on the ground. I used a container of plaster. Maybe that wasn't the best idea. Maybe use an empty container that we can kind of just push it, push it down. That's gonna be the way to get it out. Make sure it's a soft container that you can bend easily. Next time I won't use a container that is full of stuff. Hey, I just broke it free. It's been maybe, I don't know, 20 seconds, 30 seconds, just pushing it in, kind of twisting it. And I was able to, to twist it and get it loose. So let's just kind of keep twisting, pull it out. You got that. So a little tip there, use a empty container, not a full container of plaster. Um, and there's our little flower pot. Which is a perfect little, you can use it for succulents, um, whatever you want really in there. Uh, probably smart to drill a hole um, in the bottom if you want, uh, depending on what you're gonna put in there. Um, but yeah, as you can see, it's actually came out nice and smooth. Looks good, I'll maybe paint it, um, paint it or sand it down, make it a little more shinier. Um, but yeah, so there it is. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up really appreciate it um, and like always um, go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more um, and keep on doing it yourself